What's up, guys? We're just single tabling the stream right now. We're playing the money maker. Two minutes into break, we just registered actually. So just gonna start off with you all watching the first hand. I haven't played a hand as yet. Fifteen thousand stack. So yeah, we're gonna just start off fresh. I hope my voice is okay. I hope everything's okay. Just let me know if the voice seems fine to me. Eating some blueberries. Oh, can you see? Can you see? Yeah. Yep. Hmm. So yeah, let's just hope everything's okay. Been a while since I've streamed. Really excited about it, but yeah, even the camera position, right? I'm not so like yeah, I think I'm cutting myself off sometimes. Let me just adjust my seat. Oof. Feeling old. <laughs> yeah, I think this is better. Like, my head still cuts a little bit, but I'm not able to frame myself perfectly. I'm trying to adjust the camera audio, but I was trying to adjust the camera audio, but not happening. Let's go, we're live, okay. I think I just got a couple of friends joining in who know the stream's gonna start. I'm gonna add the link to my Instagram story. Link, let me get the link from YouTube. Okay, at least someone messaged means we are live, right? That's good. Hmm. <laughs> yep, we're live. We're still on start starting soon on the screen though, so. Yash Chitra is here, Anish is here, nice. Let's go. Let's start. Put on music, chill out, yeah. Put on music as well. Yep. Let's see how we can add some music. I'll just add music in a bit, just doing a couple of things. First time do snipes already for it, nothing really to explain out there. <laughs> yep. Just let me know everything's okay in the screen, like everything's cool, right? As soon as someone gets a chance. things to start with, too many things to do immediately. And some blueberries to be eaten in the process. <laughs> This music is okay. It's too loud, right? Okay, let's 
too loud. I'm gonna have to figure the music out. Just I'm gonna have to give me a little bit. It's gonna be slightly dry stream for a little bit, but we'll figure something about the music very very soon. Mm. I'm busting in a couple of tournaments. I'm really bad and stuff like that. But yeah, just I think by now my screen should be up, right? There'll be some background music coming from mine. I can see the mic moving when that background music comes, so that'd be weird, but yeah. Uh, I could 3 bet this, could call this, I don't want to fold this, definitely. So, the thing is, what are we going to do? Batman focus on a slightly tighter side, so don't mind preferring a call over a 3 bet. But I think, still a hand, I don't mind 3 betting as well. And it's early in the tournament, I mean, whatever. So I prefer early in the tournament. I generally prefer do, uh, like playing more of these hands by three betting them. Might be the wrong approach. I've heard of that, but it's the approach I'm taking this time at least. Ooh, the four bet incoming. <laughs> Window deuce. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think we just keep three betting small. Would have gone generally four point something, but our stacks are deep enough that four point that four point like eight four point nine won't get enough folds. Five point that might do a little bit, and I think we do have a decent hand. Like I think we can be good at showdown, so like could consider checking. Don't like betting too much because kind of a like bluffing with the hand, but don't get too much better to fold. So yeah, I mean I don't think if I bet you like fifteen, I don't think he's first folding versus me. So. Don't really get too much to fold. And then obviously we have this option where we're just gonna... <laughs> this looks really weird though. So I think it doesn't make sense to do this, but... Could consider just like... Donking small. I don't know, I have to see... I, to think this I don't know what will love, like I block Ace High, right? I mean, that's what I'm gonna get caught by, that's the issue. And I don't think he has too many overpairs pairs, because I don't think he checks the turn with them. So the issue is... Do I want to go? I want to go like. Why can't I think I go small this time? I think we've been starting, uh, starting call too little for the big size we do go sometimes. So I just have to keep that in mind this time. And we might get raised by him. He knows we're capable of pulling like weak, weak value out here, like thin, thin value out here. So we might get raised out here. Oh, we don't get, don't even get a call for this. Oops. Okay. Uh, four, five off on the button. I might actually open. Both of these players, nothing to be scared about. I don't know them, but the stats don't look scary enough for me to not open it. I mean, his stats are probably misleading, but his stats are like messed up a little bit, but uh, yeah. So I probably will be opening this on the button. Figure something on the music now that we have a little break from the sand. Yep, just slow in the spell. Hmm. Bottom pair can bet, can check. I prefer betting in general against someone who's on the tighter side. Get more folds than we're supposed to. Yeah, we get more folds than we're supposed to. And versus him, it actually becomes easier to like bet once and give up because since he's supposed to call it tight on the flop, he continues with a better range, so that's going to be harder to bluff off, so we don't need to pull as many bluffs. So I prefer betting once and then betting to a decent size. Don't need to go too big, too small. Random crackers going off in the background. Is the music too loud? Is it too soft? Or after the music? pause it because in case it's too loud it'll become very annoying so you're just gonna have to tell me whether it's too loud or not too loud 
जोर से बोल आई थिंक आई टॉकिंग टू सॉफ्टली दैट्स अ फर्स्ट इट्स न्यू नॉट यूज टू टॉकिंग सॉफ्टली बट आई थिंक दिस शुड बी बेटर आई जस्ट होप आई डोंट स्क्रीम इट द माइक माई ओनली इशू इज दैट आई गेस्ट इज द माइक थिंग इट राइट ये सॉरी अबाउट दैट गाइस वन डू दैट अगेन बट यू दैट्स द माइक थिंग इट कूल I forgot about my blueberry from it. Hmm. Is ten off. Open. You got a call from him on the button, which should be a tighter range than we'd expect. Last seven days, lifetime. Lifetime looks fine. Last seven days look a little tighter. I'm just talking about the V, but I didn't see the other stats actually. Hmm. Yeah, for three, but it looks fine. Looks okay. Doesn't look too tight. Yeah, pretty cool features the Bajji's given. So just like gives you an idea of how people are playing. Like you know, generally when you get like a bad beat counter or like the career stats, you get an idea of how they play in general, how long they've been here for, what they've been, what kind of stakes they've been playing, and all. You get a rough estimate. So yeah, some pretty cool features by them. Hmm. We actually found out that we dropped our VPIP very hard in the last week or so because I don't know if you see lifetime. Yep, that's our VPIP. In general, we've been playing a little more disciplined poker, to say the least. So yeah, probably looks tight on our part, but yeah, it's not really tight. It's just a little more disciplined. Still not tweaking too much. Still a thirty, a twenty-eight probably, but like thirty days. We're still a thirty, yeah. Pretty much a thirty. I think probably the last two days we've had like a cold downish. Last week, sorry, what am I saying? Hmm. So yep. GL GL brother, thank you guys. I think I just saw the chat a little bit. Sorry if I'm on a little delay with the chat. It's. Uh, It's been a while since I've streamed, yeah. <laughs> so I'm just taking a little bit to get used to it. Why am I keeping on shifting down? <laughs> Rakesh Kumar, Sahil, Virality, Anish. Who caught me a fish? Start fishing. <laughs> I think Virality man start fishing as in start like fishing and like win big hands against fish. But okay, I mean I don't think Virality caught me a fish. But I mean. He's close enough that I don't mind it. <laughs> But yeah, Anish said, "Zor se bol ya, love that. Let's go. Thank you, Yash Jaiswal. Thank you, Imran. And happy hunter. How are you, man? It's been a while. कैसे चल रहा है grind? Six five off. We're just gonna fold." Can't get fancy in these spots. I could get fancy in the button here because these guys are soft. Schemers on slightly tighter side as well, so we probably can get wide in the cutoff. Ashwin has tight stats, but I don't know. The guy does battle with me a little bit, so maybe he won't be as tight versus me as he is on the platform in general. Ah, <sighs> it's gonna adjust myself a little bit. Ah, oh, stretching out. I had a long day, right? It's Sunday, so we started early a little bit. So, I'm trying to do close to the camera, right? <laughs> But three bet carry to lagane ka hi na. Which hand is this? Abhi tak to hardly acha ace two so okay yes yes. Hmm. Lagana to abhi kuch to karna padega na, bhai three bet karke. Unfortunately, skill is not at its highest, so lagane ka power will have to use. <laughs> Schemas mark green. 
I'm not exposing my tags because that's not fair to the players or what I think of them. It's not fair to me, firstly, but it's also not fair to the players. But my tags are basically I have a color coding as player types, right? So make your age as you feel like. <laughs> but yeah. And it starts, Anish. I guess he's talking about the age 2 student hand. It was a good start, but pretty cold after that. But I mean, I don't mind it. Hmm. Oh, oh no. Okay. We are folded from the big line anyway versus the two bigs, but the six definitely makes our life easier. Let me get the hang of this and we might actually stream two tables. We'll probably stream the super stack as well. But let me get a stack in that. I'm just one more bust with that. Obviously we'll rebuy, but it'll be more fun if we do get a stack in play. That is the playstyle I enjoy. Have a big stack. Go aggressive. And hopefully don't get screwed. Hmm. He ripped his remaining 12 eggs with this. What did I miss in the action? To see the action. I don't know what I missed. I'm gonna have to figure out. Hmm. Oh, he lost a big hand with Queen 10. Okay. Yeah, yeah. What's your year? Good question, good question. Uh, call girl. Thank you so much. Hmm, thank you. Oh uh, yeah, Queen Ten was Queen Jack. Wait, I think not too standard. Might might be a bigger pot than should have been, but okay, not the worst. And then yeah, okay, six wigs. My bad. A six pixel jacket off, maybe skip, but I mean, it's too early. Who cares? Just sleep by and live your life. Live to fight. Hmm. It's better now, the voice? Yeah. Cool. Amplitude and frequency in the same. Hmm. Are you talking about the voice? Are you talking about. That's the only way I know amplitude and frequency merge, right? And voice. I mean, that's the only place I use the two words together. I don't know. And we're done with our blueberries. It was nice. How many... People do we have? Is the sound? Is the music? Was the music fine? If y'all heard it already, because I don't know that if the music's good. I'm gonna keep playing it. Sunday is Rebuy City everywhere. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's fine. Yeah. It's life, you know. This has been grinding, getting pretty unlucky with a couple of hands in different places. And yeah, money maker again, nothing really. 7 10 off again. Don't want to open this from the cutoff. We'll probably open like. Yeah, this is what I meant. You saw the snap folds? Seems like on the tighter side, I can obviously be wrong and they could just have like two score off, but in general, seems like that folds. I'll still open this from here though. Might not seem as good, but I'd probably do this more often than I would do that. He did, he did, I don't know what are we talking about here. My bad. I Collingwood, stealing my spot. <laughs> Two people stole my. And thank God we didn't get involved then. What do I need to do? I need to do some other work as well. 
I'm very new to this, so I'm like kind of remembering a couple of things. <laughs> not very new, it's been a while actually. Not, I mean, I'm still new to it as well, but my main issue is it's been a while. So it's taking a while to remember some, some things. As to what I need to get checked. All good, Aryan. That's very nice to hear, man. Are you planning to come to Vietnam or Goa? Any of them in May? I think there are two series in May, right? Two live trips. I'm still confused between both. And I'm confused in the third option, which is called going for neither. <laughs> I mean, probably. Yeah, we'll see. We'll decide that. Bag Nano. Yeah, I bagged about like 15 bags in that one. Nothing special. Just. Not having a great Sunday till now, but it's too early, so don't really care too much. But yeah, it's not having a great Sunday till now. Rebought a couple of times in the super value. I think a bullet in the super. S no, super stack we didn't have to rebuy. Okay, we got lucky in that spot. <laughs> I think 40 bigs effective. Um, it came. Raise, call, 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 call. Like four callers. And we have 40 bigs in a screen in the small blind. We ripped, ran into 10s, and clipped a queen. Not very really lucky, but like we won a flip, basically. But yeah, that was the only one hand. Which 40 bigs, I think, is a starting stack? Somewhere around that? Mm, yeah, about 50 bigs is a starting stack, yeah. So that, but super value, I think we had to rebuy a couple of times. I don't know how many though. Only once, okay. Neither of them are going too bad then. That's everything else ever getting screwed. <laughs> Ace is in the super stack. Okay, so we have aces in the super stack and the flop is a7-7 in a 3 bet pot. That is cool. Life is easy and he bets. I actually checked it because it's like I'm not even... I'm gonna check with a couple of hands like kings, queens, jacks and... Aces I don't mind checking because it's not like I can get too much value from anything. He's betting two streets though, it's pretty crazy. Don't know whether I'll get any more value from this hand. Do I get any more value? Oh, wow, I got third street as well. And he's bet like big. He's bet 25 bigs into 45 and a half, 45 remaining, so I'm just gonna dip. And he folds. Yeah, I felt like a bluff. I mean, he couldn't really have too much value, right? He had aces on ace 7 7. So. Still, I think then got the max for sure. If we bet or something, I don't think we get even close to what we got. Not bad. Not a bad start to that one. Suyog, thank you so much, man. Good luck to whoever else is grinding there as well. I hope to see you on the moneymaker table. Let me know if you're grinding. Let me know what your ID is, obviously. And yeah, let me know if any interesting spots do come up. We can discuss that on the stream as well. If you have some cool spots that came up in the moneymaker. Because often people have been playing a little funky. So like a lot of cool spots are coming up, a lot of fun spots. And a lot of like crazy spots are coming up where people are getting a little out of line and it's becoming a lot of fun to play with but it's also becoming a little annoying because we are sometimes losing money so if i'll have any cool spots anirban thank you so much man did none of you hear the music till now that's very weird Because it's a six minute delay and so if it's a six minute delay basically waiting for you all to say you my question now and then reply to that and then I see it and then I have to play it so you'll have to wait for like a whole additional amount of minutes to hear that. So yeah. Hmm. I don't know why I'm adjusting. I'm keeping on looking on the right and somehow my face is always out of the camera. <laughs> just give me a second. Every time I look on the right I'm like wait where am I even sitting? Like, why is it just cutting my face off? Can't stand. What the hell is going on? What is the correct angle? And I'm moving in my seat as well right? So, Still gonna cut, I guess. I'm still gonna have to adjust this. Okay, fold six four shooter for sure. Sorry guys, just gonna have to adjust. I think.
think this is the best I can do. In this, my head will still cut a little bit, but I mean, my face is cutting off way weirder. Like every time I'm seeing it still here somehow, I'm like, ah, how the hell did I move that much? We will eventually stand and grind as well, so for a bit we do that for sure. Uh, why is the chat box not loading? Just give me one second, guys. Somehow. Okay, can you all see the chat on screen as well? Something's acting up in my streaming software. Ugh. I see again my face is cutting. How the hell am I moving so much? What the hell is going on? I have to sit like this perpetually. Hey, Sai is here. What's up? How are you, man? Thank you so much. Divya, thank you so much as well. How many viewers do we have? I have to check it on my phone because I don't have a link open on my PC because I don't want sounds to merge. Hmm. I mean, sorry guys if you'll hear me on echo, but I'm just going to hear myself. Let's see. that. Bag Nano. Yeah, bag for like 15 bags in that one. Okay. Nothing special. Just, yeah, face is cutting. Not having a great channel until now, but it's too early, so I don't really care too much. Uh, yeah, it's not having a great channel. Sorry if I seem like a narcissistic person watching my own video. Just checking out some stuff. Looks okay. Looks fine. Looks good. Oh, by the way, obviously, please uh, like, like the stream, subscribe to the channel, and stay off as, as long as you can. It'll be a fun one. I think we should convert. We've also packed a good amount of bullets for it. So, what's up, Karan Satlani? How are you? Came to stream the table. Came to see the funky shit I do so you can catch it. <laughs> but, yeah. What's up, how are you? How have you been, man? Been a long time. Seeing that I'm not cutting myself out of camera. A little focused on that. It looks okay. But I'm not moving as much now. But I am too conscious now, so. <laughs> not cutting again. What am I running into? These random hands.
just checking some back end stuff as well. Anyway, what's up? How many of you are here actually right now? What, 20? I guess, I hope. 19 watching, yeah? So, how's it going? What's up? How's your grind been? What are you all playing these days? How was the NPS for all? That's the main question, I think. How was the NPS for all or how is actually Moneymaker going for all? Because Moneymaker is also like fun, right? Every single day, a 1 crore guaranteed. That's pretty crazy. So how has that been going? How is that grind going? And even with the free tickets, they're giving out like one ticket every single day and a deposit code. It's insane. I think all of us have been like maxing out off of it. Really crazy. <sighs> Sanjay bhai, how are you? How is it going? Thank you so much for the good luck. And good luck to you because it's Sunday and I'm assuming you're grinding. Queen 5 off. <laughs> Should we fight back? Okay, someone stole our spot to fight back. I wasn't sure whether we were gonna fight back, but it was a it was an option we could take. But now we're not fighting back. If I suit is definitely a decent hand. Can limp, obviously. I prefer raising these in general. Might not be the most optimal strategy, but it's a strategy I like for a couple of reasons. Jack do suited again, nothing we can do. Three bet a little higher up, like something like Jack eight suited, I wouldn't mind three betting in this spot. Jack do suited is kind of unnecessary pulling. five off we can definitely open at least but we could have done something funky here as well if someone let us but no one let us again my head is cutting my god uh, every time i look up it's disappointment no major disappointment just the fact that my head is cutting and i'm being weird and not sitting straight or whatever but like yeah.
Deuce 4, 7. <laughs> don't mind checking, don't mind betting, don't mind check raising. All three options are good. I prefer check raising this time. And again, don't mind checking, check calling. I don't think we're check folding. I don't like check raising the turn as much because now it's more likely that we're actually good if he bets here than if he bets on the flop. And we have to face one less trait of aggression, right? But yeah, and this river actually really helps us, so it's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, just gonna check again. I don't think we're folding either. I mean, obviously, if he bombs it or something, we're folding. Yep. Clean thought process, or at least I think so. Again, a hand we're definitely going to be opening in this position. But have probably, like, uh, <laughs> calling wood. Do we try something funky with calling wood? That is the question. Early in the stream, I say no. But we'll try something half funky. I mean, if he folds, we can consider 3 betting. It, I mean, we shouldn't, but we would have done it anyway. And. A big bet now. Annoying, annoying, annoying. I bet like something smaller. It becomes very expensive to check raise this one, that's the only issue. Um, I don't like calling though. We close the action. We have some backdoor straight and backdoor flush draws, but that's about it. It's kind of optimistic. It's kind of optimistic. We didn't do the funky on the pre flop, so we tried doing it. If we could do something funky, this turn doesn't help us, so I think we're done with the hand. But yeah, I mean, even if he checks, I think we're done with it. This turn doesn't really help either of us, so if he had a hand that... Hmm, I don't think he really... Yeah, okay, cool. Just unnecessary funk. Pokemon is here. Hey, Arjen, thank you so much, Pokemon. Uh, Pankaj is here. Samir is here. Hmm, <laughs> money maker hasn't been true to its name, it's taken my money every day. I mean, it depends, it has its flows, because when you get the money, you're gonna get a lot of it as well, so. That's the nature of the game, you know? Sometimes you gotta give it back, and sometimes you're gonna get a lot of it. I've had a pretty okay -ish run, money maker, like running a little above EV, uh, a little above break even, not above EV. Little bit break even on that because of the payout structure. I really like actually the money makers payout structure currently. So it's actually like really beneficial. Like you hit 50 then you get 50k in a 5k buy in, which is really cool. So the way they've currently favored the payouts is really interesting. It's really good. It's something new. It's not what I've seen a lot of websites do. So yeah. Jacket suited. I'm gonna bet a little bigger on this flop just because the flush drop doesn't. Otherwise, you could have got definitely way smaller. Just the flush drop makes us go a little bigger. One hand we're gonna fold. And you see how the weep up comes to 34, right? When you play like funky hands, the weep up just comes up on its own. Not a good way of doing it. Someone's asked for something and I cannot understand what it is. Just give me a second, I'm gonna have to read it properly. Why can you please change the theme of your background? Uh I cannot change that actually. That's preset and yeah. But I will take that into consideration for the next time for sure. Thank you so much. And I'm sorry about today, but it is the way it is. But yep. Yeah. 
it's a preset so basically i cannot change it today because i'll have to work on the back end of my obs of my streaming software which right now when i'm playing multiple tables doesn't help uh, i mean is it possible but later i'll look into it definitely if you're saying that's a concern anyone else feeling it or just even on you because i have not heard of this complaint before so i don't know so really new to me i'm not saying the complaint is not welcome that's totally okay but i just again my head is cutting my god i just have it heard it before Hmm. Again, a very wide open. I know that I'm very aware of how wide it is, but we're on stream. So if you're not having fun, what are we doing? Yeah, can go a little smaller as well, yo. But this is fine. I don't think it makes too much sense to go bigger. It's a do straight. If the third card was like an eight or seven, I probably could consider going bigger. And now we actually have a hand. So now we're gonna can check and bet small again. But the problem with betting small again is I don't know what we're getting too much value from. <clears throat> the only good thing is if I do get raised, I don't expect to ever be up against a bluff, or not ever, but like very rare to be up against a bluff. So it's okay. We can probably fold, but it'll be like a pretty high up fold, which gets annoying. That's the only issue I have with it. One of the only issues. One of the only. Yep, my English is sucking right now. One of the issues I have with it—that's my major concern, though. But I mean, the hand gets through, and that's cool. Queen do soft. I think we just fold. No point of getting funky with that. Probably ace do soft. We can do something. King do soft. I would have considered. I don't know. That's optimal, but I would have considered. Queen do soft is just calling for a fight, and I'm not doing that with players who are pretty decent. Schema being one of them, so. Does no one have any stories from their money maker hands? Like money maker has been having a crazy amount of hands, like a crazy amount of crazy hands is what I'm trying to say. No one has those stories. Someone calling them off. Someone calling that twenty big shove with like king four suited and clipping. Really? Wow. You guys are lucky. You guys are pretty lucky. I've been having a lot of those for as well. So yeah. People calling off wide, and we're gonna three bet this again. It's a good spot to three bet, and the only issue is it's gonna look like I'm attacking him, which actually I'm not. Like two times we three bet, and we have a pretty decent candidates to three bet. But I know he's someone who will fight back eventually, so we're gonna have to just calm down a little bit. Probably skip like the third break even spot three bet we get versus him. Hmm. This is definitely not a board that's good for us. Or. This is not a board. A board. I think it's good for us, and especially with the way we three bet, right? Three bet a lot more junky hands. Yeah. Just gonna give up this one. Let him have it. I'm just having some coffee. Oh my god! How the hell do I place this camera correctly so that when I sit like this, it's not cutting, and when I sit like this, it's not cutting? <laughs> This is my challenge for the day. Let me just try, try something, try something. Uh, this is now not cutting like this, but this is a very weird angle for you guys, I think. It's what I'm thinking, and this is definitely burning my face. Oh yeah. Anyway, we're gonna stand for a bit, so I'm just gonna take a table. Upstairs. I had to do this, but this is not fun for you guys, right? Hmm. I forgot the fact that my camera might not stretch as much as I wanted to. So just give me a second. I'm gonna do something about the camera. Don't worry. And this anyway feels a little too high. Yeah, it's looking. Okay. I do 
not have a camera? Hey, you kidding me? No, we do have it. We do have it. We do have it. It's just about making it. So, yeah. It's just about making it. And the 62 suited folds. And this. Just go stand and play for a while because Sunday, right? So, Sunday gets pretty long if you're just sitting all the time. So yeah, I'm gonna stretch a little bit. Ah, feels nice. God, move the chair, man. But yeah, currently have like five or six tables running. GG. Why GG? It's not GG, it's GL, but thank you so much, man. I think I get the emotion. I hope I get the emotion. Oh. Head is cutting even in this, dude. What the fuck do I do? Ayah. Can y'all see that? Y'all can't see the chat, right? That's very weird to me. Here for a second, there's something weird. Yeah, she's loading for a second, bouncing. I don't know what's going on. Okay. Size of the display, something to do with that. I can't understand. Oh, it's just starting. Zalim, thank you so much. Zalim. I just said Zalim. Okay. Is my face all this cutting? What the hell? Where do I stand? Where do I? What is up with my camera? There's something funky because this is not normal. My face is cutting like legit everywhere I'm standing. I mean, I can't move like two inches, which is very uncomfortable. So, been a break from the streaming life, right? Probably anyway, you can't do it when you're streaming, but it's been so long that I don't remember. Might pull the trigger in another tournament that we have. <laughs> he didn't let me bluff. Okay. Okay then, sir. Pot was like 20 bigs. River the flush complete. We had the ace of spades. Would have pulled the trigger in general. But he let into us 25 bigs and ripped. Okay then. Saved me some bigs, I guess.
bro, you can't win this match. You are too weak. Okay. I mean, fair enough. That's an opinion I respect. But why do you think so? I mean, I think I'm decent, yeah. <laughs> I don't think I'm too bad. If you just said you are weak, I don't mind. You said you are too weak. That hurt a little bit. <laughs> but yeah. You have the same name as me as well. Feedback from Asuran. This stack is not great to flat this. I think if he had like 50, I would have called. This is not fun. Fold this one. Chat is opening and glitching, right? I'm trying to figure something out with that as well. That's weird. Yeah, it's, I don't know why it's glitching. I'm trying everything out. Do whatever I understand about streaming. Obviously, I'm not the best, so. Life is unfair. They gave me a walk. Boring, but I mean, I don't mind free money, but it's boring for a stream, especially. Okay, the break is gonna start after this hand, and we're gonna be folding. So, this is the last hand before the break. See you in a bit, guys.
What's up guys, we're back. 45 seconds, 44 seconds or something. With the breaks over and we're back. We got the chat in somehow. That was hard, but we got it. What can we do with that? I think we'll be opening, but if you op if someone opens, like especially if he opens, we call. If he opens, it's pretty ugly. Too short a stack to fight with, especially, and then there are stacks behind like Madcat who kind of. I didn't know he could, but he could apparently. So yeah. Looks like a fun hand. Looks like one of those action hands. Kripanch is jealous. Fucking go. Thank you, buddy. Ah, what? 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 Twenty-three-six-seven. Well, this guy is not as tight as I thought he was. My bad. Is did he get marked? What the hell? But yeah, he called off King Queen off for 23 bits. I don't think that's right. You think? Bro, you should focus on look maxing. I think he means luck boxing. I don't know what he means. But yeah, man, I'm always focused on that though. <laughs> I'm always focused on luck boxing at the same time. Something I can't control though, so I don't put too much attention into it. But whatever little attention I can give to lockboxing, definitely put my attention there. Mukesh Pai is here. How are you, man? Good luck, good luck. Thank you, good luck, bro. Nandan here as well. Thank you so much, man. Good luck to you as well. Some poker chips I keep playing with. So yeah. I see how just one of hope the sound is not too disturbing. Okay, yeah, it is loud. Hope the chips are out. <coughs> or at least looks loud. I don't know. I can't actually hear it right. Ace King of Suit. Batman can rip again? No. Hmm. Or I don't mind checking actually. Might be a bet, but I. <laughs> Do we want to gamble with him? I think with the Ace of Hearts it'd be a slightly easier call, but I don't think he jams in a flush anyway, so it doesn't matter too much. Ace King, two overs and a flush draw. What's the prize, I think? Oh yeah, I think we'll gamble with them. 
Forty-six fifty four. Okay. Hmm. Might not be a call in theory, but I don't mind it. Against him, and we better get rid of him. What are you all doing there in the Ace King spot? Are you all calling? Are you all folding? Are you all thinking I'm stupid that I called? <laughs> Which one of three? Took away my stop and go spot. Annoying. Annoying. Yeah, it would have been such a crazy stop and go spot. Why you do this to me? Queen is on six bigs. I think time to go. Time to go. Time to go. <laughs> can fold. Can go. Very deep and straight. Don't mind taking the spot when someone calls as well because if someone re squeezes and. Did not expect that ever happening. But as I mentioned, some funky stuff has been happening these days. <laughs> At this stage, six bigs and two people fold after opening. After opening and calling. I have no idea what's happening. Chip and Chai, what's up? How are you, man? Good luck, bro. I'm trying to get your stream run, money. <laughs> stream run and stream run good. Get the bracelet. Stretching for the 
Well, we're just gonna go back to the door, do shut. Let me see that I don't cut my face out again. This is good. No, it's not. How can I be this bad with technology? It's so weird. Technology and like. Fat, fatty person. Ah! Oh. Just sit with my legs crossed so I don't move too much. It's gonna get. They not actually, so let's swap that out for a bit. Just gonna mute my camera and webcam for a bit. But yeah. I'll be back, boys. What's up? We're back. Arjun Ragani is your Mohit is your last fucking Mohit. Good luck. Thank you, boys. Thank you. How's your grind going? I've seen you guys grind now. So. Yep. How's it going? Is my camera automatically moving? I can't understand what's going on. This is not making any logical sense. Oh my god, this is going off frame at the same time. It's getting annoying to me. How do we test? How do we even test whether the camera is moving or not? Because I can't understand what's going on. Okay, I'm gonna have to test it, like just seeing if the thing the camera is moving slightly slightly. Huh, that's annoying. But okay, it's life. Shit happens. Jack fall off, we're just gonna fold. But yeah. Yeah, it's moving really slightly, but it is because I can just see like it was your my like I don't know how to explain it like just went up. We have to explain, but yeah, it is moving very slightly. But it's moving very slightly in a little bit, so it's gonna get annoying because my table is a little shaky, right? Sometimes it's that sit stand desk, which is not the like it is sturdy, but it's not the most like shake proof, so to say.
made my life easier by limping him. Definitely. And now he made my life tougher on this floor. Okay, that's good. I hope it goes check check again though. That's too optimistic. Yeah, we'll still be calling this with our gut shot. And life is easy when you hit the river. Yep, life is pretty easy when you hit the river. Easy call is in uh, on the flop. We have King of Hearts in the hand, 45% of our equity on the jam call. We have King Nine of Hearts, 3k. So, um, can't see the rest of the message. It's getting blocked by the emoji. So, well, for me, it's a good call. I am honestly not sure whether we do have the right equity with that. Uh, hand. But I think it's fine. I don't think it's bad. I don't think it's like, oh shit, what are you calling? I think it's, uh, it can fold, it can call. If you want to avoid the variance, fold. You want to take the variance, call. And I do not mind taking the variance in general. So, yep, we will call. As I think someone said upstairs, where you should focus on luck boxing. That's what I'm trying, buddy. That is what I'm trying. And I think I said it earlier, but I'm going to say it again. Whoever still hasn't liked, if you can, leave a like, subscribe to the channel. We're going to have streams for the rest of the week, so that should be super fun. And yeah, that I hope you do subscribe. I hope you're enjoying it. If you're not enjoying, tell me what we can change. Some things might be harder to change today, obviously, but we can change it for the next time. If you want to change me, then that's going to be a little harder than that. But I think my playstyle is entertaining enough, isn't it? I think we're playing fun poker, so to say. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> These ace high boards. I think 1. 1.3, 1.4 is fine. One point, check is obviously fine. Prefer betting ace high boards in general with like basically a range. Especially when you open the stacked up, right? We have lesser air balls. And are there any bad river? Are there any worse rivers for us? I mean, what the hell can come on the river that's bad? Like 10 of diamonds? I don't even know. 10 of diamonds isn't bad. Jack of hearts isn't bad either. But the board was bad enough before that, so. Still gonna find it. Still gonna have to find it. Uh, yeah. yeah, this sizing it's I mean problem is it's hardly a bluff, but the other problem is it's too cheap. So yeah. Things happen with that. Uh, didn't think he'd put that hand on the flop wasn't my stack size. Not the worst float, but I told you he's gonna fight a little harder. Or at least that's what I've seen, so yeah. I think I still like my bet on the flop, I still like my check on the turn. Maybe the we can fold, but I don't mind the call there definitely. If he's floating King 7, he's floating way too many hands out there in general. Because the back toes aren't as valuable, right, against my stack, because my stack is not big enough for the back toes to have the implied odds they need to hit. Nishant Chaudhary, hi man, how are you? Good luck, good luck, thank you man, good luck to you as well. I don't even think now the camera's moving, now it's hitting just me moving. Uh, yeah, yeah. I 
compared with this you can see that it's just gonna block some it's okay actually it makes it a little better I don't know because it's like just see how much of the max I can pull it till because I don't wanna block it still but I think this takes some more of the empty space though. So yeah. I think this is okay, right? Because it's just a little more zoomed in. And tell me if it's feeling uncomfortable, I'll just change that back. But I don't think it should be. Krish AA is a big fish calling station. I don't think about I don't think I'm a big fish, but calling station I will somewhat have to agree. I mean it's kind of unfair if I don't. But yeah. What hand did you see me calling off? The ace king of heart ace king with the king of hearts? I don't think that's that stationy, but okay. This hand is gonna go easy, easy, easy going. And obviously, <laughs> it's an easy life. I mean, you can pretty station pretty hard when you have this on, right? <laughs> life becomes easier. One more call. Come on, let's go. Let's add some more dead money into the pot. Thank you. A couple of you guys could have helped as well, but it's okay. Can't be too pissed. Now if it goes call, 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 I'll be a little shocked. <laughs> yep. Yeah, I like this actually. I really like this. Yeah. Do we need the auto rebuy? Maybe we don't. I don't think we do. Okay. We chop up something, so we do win something. Yeah, eight, nine legs. But yeah. Not the worst start of the day. We're gonna late dredge the BSS sprint as well. So we have that running as well. We have we already have the super stack running. We busted out the super value. A little bumming, but can't win every tournament, you know. And we're trying to win the money maker today, so the others can take a back seat. It's not even my camera that's moving now. No, I think it's just me moving. Because this time the camera looks fine. I think it just has a slight move when I adjust it, when I set it up. But after that I think it stays because now it's just me moving. I can see because the, the places are locked to basically understand if it's moving or not, they're in the exact same location. Like the, you see the back of the sofa? Back of the sofa. This part, I was checking whether it moves up or down. I kept something on the right of it. It hasn't moved a bit, so it's basically me who has moved. Okay, good to know. and we fold
station somewhere else paid the price as well. So you might be right about calling station. <laughs> station the BS is actually with ASI on the river. And he had bottom pair and he value bet against me. Didn't think he value bet that, which is why I stationed. But thought process wasn't great, I guess, then. I mean, thought process was fine, the uh, read wasn't great. The read wasn't great. Was a board where a couple of hands had missed, and uh, I didn't think he value bet like bottom pair. But I mean, it makes sense to do it. I just didn't think it was a random opponent who I didn't think would do it. And I was wrong. King it off. I might actually open on this spot. In this exact spot. Not a great spot in general, but yeah. I think King 9 off IPR open here, right? So, King it off on this table. Kira Poker is a little funky actually off late. He's not the same player I thought he was playing like in the start. But yeah. Okay, now he's just avoided. It's anyway like very, very wide and then a scooper if you have to get a limp and play it after that it's not great hmm. nice layout okay thank you so much man Okay, some people do like it then. Fair. We have 30 people watching, nice. Just randomly checking in on my own stream to see how it's going. I feel like eating some like snacky food today. And I've kind of cut down on ordering from outside and stuff. But yeah, I just feel like eating some like unhealthy, not so great shit today. Opening this a little wide, but I mean, it's okay ish. I think King 6 suited RP or open here, yeah, so. King 4 suited. Did not see this, but that's my read on him, so. I will not be for any 2.2 picks. And generally, this read actually doesn't make a. doesn't like play well out here because his, the greed is he calls off any 2, but. Uh, even assuming he calls off any two, he wouldn't do this with something. Ah, uh, okay, I don't think he's... Okay, I think I messed this up. Hmm, let's see how he plays this up, because this doesn't look as bad as this. A4, F4, yeah, I think either exploiting me or got not work, but yeah. Hmm, this we will... I think we start opening too much. He, because he's catching on it, he's pushing because this was... Maybe a push actually. 
Ah, uh, he's had a few recent scores. Does anyone? to stay in frame, I can't understand, I've never faced this issue in my life before, or at least I've never been told about it so much, where I'm just getting kicked out of frame every second. Hmm. They should be folded, and I think we'll follow the fold part. Don't really like playing this in position against someone who I think is decently competent. So, pretty competent actually. So, yeah, just gonna skip on the. I would play it against someone who I think isn't gonna see bet enough, isn't gonna like aggress enough. I don't think he's one of them. Three crore guaranteed qualifier. I played a hand against you, and I was betting on my set of kings on king queen two rainbow, and you had tens. I never denied I was a station. I said I was a station. I know that about myself. <laughs> it's not new to me. But what was the dynamic like? How early in the tournament was this? Hey Tanay, how are you? Good luck, man. Thank you so much. King queen two rainbow, and you were holding tens, and I guess a jam. You still called me straight on the river. Really? How old are you with this? That just sounds a little too wide for me as well, but... I'm not saying you're wrong. You could be very right, but I just don't think it would be this exact scenario. And if you are, then I'm sorry, man. It's the game, and I am a station, and it's the game, which sometimes rewards my bad plays. I don't think my play was good in any way with the tens. If that's exactly the way you're explaining it and that's how it happened, I don't support my play. But yeah. Just flat out a three bet with King three suited, so I kind of know I'm station like that. <laughs> I realize it every like five minutes that I'm pretty much stationing off in the wrong spot. Unfortunately, it turns out to be the right spot so often that I kind of have that bias in my head that a lot of spots which I should be folding are still being taken. So yes, going back to my main important point for the day, I wanted to order some unhealthy food. That was my plan for the night. We're oh, breaking hard today, breaking hard. Uh, Bricked a couple of tournaments pretty early. Uh, yeah, just getting smoked today. And multiple bullets, obviously. So yeah, just not that kind of day. Not the day we wanted, but it's fine. It's poker, right? It's gonna have its ups and downs. Hmm. Joshua, and I think the NPS camper, right? How are you, man? Thank you so much. Good luck to you as well. My face is cutting again. Yeah. Gonna open some 
food delivery app and we're gonna go for some yum food I would ask her for a suggestion, but by the time a suggestion comes, it'll become too late because there's delay, man. I hate streaming with a delay, but like, you need it for the safety of the game and stuff like that. It's really annoying to not be able to talk live. You batted half a stack on the turn. Uh, you batted half a stack on the turn, and again, you got for a so now, now you will. And you hit that, and now that's why there's no chance for beginners against you guys. Lagato bus. I mean, it's not us guys. Like I'm probably wider than a lot of players. So like station stationing, probably most people wouldn't have stationed you in that spot. So you don't have to worry about the getting stationed that easily. But uh, and by it was a good call. Like you should be happy I made that call in general. Just unfortunate. I'm telling you, it was like really bad timing. Otherwise. It was actually a very bad play on my part. I just got lucky. I buried my half stack on the turn because it was a jack on the turn. Uh, King Queen Jack, I'm assuming that means King Queen does Jack. Yeah, still not a call. I still don't think I should be calling there, but I still think I do have my calling tendencies. I cannot deny that. Cutting it down a little bit, but probably you're not seeing it today because on stream I'm playing also a little more fun poker, to say the least. I think the King Nine of Hijack open the standard, so it doesn't. It doesn't qualify as fun poker, but yeah. And you hit, that's why. You hit, and now that's why there's no chance for beginners against you guys. You guys talk about study and all on, your, on the stream, off the stream, could be. Uh, no, bro. I, I do study in general. I do talk about it on the stream and off the stream. I still do make some mistakes and on the stream and off the stream, which is going to happen, I think, throughout my life. I hope it keeps reducing. But there'll be some of the other mistake at all times because... I don't know how much you studied poker, but poker study is very intensive. So like, even if I do study pretty hard, which I already don't, but even if I do study pretty hard, uh, it'll be like, it's almost impossible to know exactly what to do in every spot, right? And then obviously my calling station tendencies have to be pulled down and stuff like that. So you're not wrong, but you are wrong about the fact that I think you guys talk about studying all on the stream or off the stream. I don't think I play very different off the stream. I think I play pretty similar off the stream as well. And there are spots are station, like the Ace King to a lot of people would have been a station spot, right? So, uh, yeah. The Ace King with the King of Hearts on that board, like 5 9 deuce? 9 5 deuce, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, that was as well. That was a station spot as well. And if he jammed there and I hit my heart, probably he would be the guy also saying, Ki, you guys just station off anything. So, like, it's not like I'm not stationing on stream. I am stationing. The same way I would in real life. Just not getting the spots and probably thinking about it a little bit on stream today. So yeah. Finally my face isn't cutting, finally I'm not moving, I'm legit like keeping my legs stuck on this stool below my feet so I don't move ahead. It's just your body lazes out right, so you like go like this and eventually move. <laughs> I'm have to adjust again. Yeah. But yeah, I know that will happen so I just better. My food is here, not the order, just my normal food. Alright. DJ. 
Well, limp along. He's making her life easy with that. So, he didn't make her life easy, though. Could actually limp a little bit out here, but just not this hand in particular. Give me a pretty messed up hand to them in this part.
sorry about the food guys just dead hungry have eaten something since evening at the evening i mean ah took my spot evening as an early evening can't call it lunch actually because that's the last thing i ate i just ate really late i ate like 4 4 15 but yeah that's the last thing i ate properly some burger and some fries I'm done with this meal I'm a little tempted to do some funky shit. But no. sit like that with my lock, legs lock lock legs a little lock huh, how do I match this is something we don't mess up but my English we keep messing up oh just stretching we want to call obviously from the big line it's good to get a call here It's not moving, it's getting damn annoying, but again, it's part of the game, can't do too much. Yeah man, I get it, it's not about the harsh words, don't worry about it, I don't really mind the language. Try not to abuse, but uh, like people, I'm not telling you this, you don't abuse, but I'm telling you because See a lot of people abusing on the tables and this and that. Try not to abuse. Try to keep the environment a little friendly. But I understand where, how you're feeling because it's happened to me a couple of times as well. And we probably feel it a little lesser because it's like practically the job we're doing every day and like grinding multiple tournaments and like, you know, in multiple spots like this. So you kind of get used to it over time. So I definitely understand you probably feel way worse than we would in the same scenario. And that's, that's okay. That's understandable. But I don't think that really helps you. That like kind of pull you down when you're playing so just uh try to avoid like try to avoid getting too caught up in who played bad and who didn't uh try to if anything if use it to your like you know your advantage for playing better against that opponent but try to avoid getting too caught up in oh these guys are so bad or these guys did this or these guys did that kind of feels like it'll waste your time so it's just spot after spot uh kind of feels like it'll waste your time and like you know it kind of tilt you off not make you play your best none of that stuff I actually just had this in the BSS sprint someone just like ripped a very funky hand against me and clipped can't do too much just no noted that he did that so that you know next time I know that I can call off wider against him and that's okay because he's jamming way too wide 
Because my hand was already like, I thought it was closed, but against him, it looked like a slam dunk. Yeah. So it just happens where people will like three bet call off weird. He three bet called off, sorry. But I didn't want to jam against him, but I took it anyway, ace jack, and he three bet called off queen jack off. So whatever. So now I know I can jam very wide against him, right? So because he might actually call off worse for value. Like you can actually start jamming ace ten suited and stuff. Because if he three bet calls off queen jack off, I think he's doing it with king queen off, king jack off, those kind of hands, right? So. This is in the BSS sprint. I saw that early right now. It's like, yeah, it's 640, right? It's not like the first level, second level, something like that. So, not worth caring too much about who gives you a bad beat. I understand it gets more frustrating when someone who you think knows the game does it and gets a little more annoying, but I mean, I have my tendencies, man. I can't. You're not wrong. I do have some funky hands I play. Anyway, boys, I will be back after the break. See you.
guys just back. Let's have a little washroom and stuff. A little longer. Normal. I just realized I was actually watching my own stream just to see everything and y'all probably can't see the low area where I'm making my decision. So does that matter? Does that affect y'all? Does that not affect? Time to learn how to crush Bazi. From me, not the best person to learn how to crush Bazi from me, but I hope this stream can help a little bit. But honestly, yeah, I don't think I'm the best person to learn crushing Bazi from. And I misclicked somewhere. And we lost four big blinds. Cool. Uh, small blind opened a spot. We had a deuce off in the big way to fold. I misclick call. And he opened to like four bigs. And the BSS print itself. Yep. Got the BSS print and the BSS super stack running. BSS super stack, we have about 40 bigs. BSS print, we have about 90 bigs. So the three bigs didn't hurt, but the stupidity is a little annoying. I feel like opening this jack 10 off. Obviously not a good decision, obviously we will not succumb to our weird obsession with opening bad hands. Just gonna, yep. Uh, Babaji, that's the na nature of the game, man. I know it gets annoying, it gets annoying to us as well. Uh, in the event I made the sati through, I'll just read it out. In that event I made the entry through sati and my 8 hours went in vain because there was nothing to leave. There was nothing to learn from that session. I'll never be so gutsy to call my life tens over there. I know, I know. I, I told you, I don't think that's a call. I'm not supporting my call in any way. If that's exactly the action. Probably the action could have gotten mixed up a little bit, but I'm not telling you you're wrong. I'm just saying that like seems a little too wide for me as well. Uh, but again, I can't put it above me. So, yeah. But uh, definitely, yeah, don't, don't learn that if anything. Learn probably not to do that and learn one more thing that even though we play like high stakes and play decently and play, I will say a little decent poker for the rest of the time that we will pass and make mistakes and it's human, right? Not justifying my mistake, just telling you how it is. But yeah, eight hours went in vain. <laughs> Again, try not to get caught up in that because that's the nature of the game, right? If you're playing, it's very often you're going to play a lot of tournaments and you're going to spend hours and hours and end up coming like 10, 12th in a field and get like 5, 10, 8 buy-ins back. That's why I said, Bazi's payout structure in this money maker actually is really good because when you come like 50th, you get like 10 buy-ins back, which is so rewarding. It's insane. Uh, yeah, because also even the satis, right? The Bazi satis and all feels so good. I think every day they have a sati at 4 p.m. and 6 p.m. The 3.45 buy-in. And I think 4 p.m. it's 30 seats. 6 p.m. it's 50 seats. So, yeah. I know because I was grinding a lot of those, actually. I have actually been grinding a little bit of the sati scene as well because just to, like, play a little tight and feel that game as well. Uh, but for uh, that, for just a fact purpose, I haven't cracked a single one of them, so probably not the best at playing tight. And we know that, but we still try to learn every day. to get our stack moving in this. We're going to avoid pushing the action, especially with these kind of hands. Jack 10 was the one where we were pushing the action, still avoiding it. Not good enough in general. Am I cutting my face again? My God. I realize you cannot kept my leg on the stool, so I realize I'm probably cutting my face again. Yep, no, we're not, I guess. No, we aren't. Okay. Ten for suit again. 
hoping it, gets, it got checked to us, but nope. We don't get to decide how the game's gonna go. And we might bust our first bullet in... No, we don't. Oh no, we don't. Okay, we got a funky call on the. <laughs> this is a fun hand for sure. But yeah, someone. So we don't bust. I thought we bust the super stack. Basically, we ISO from the small blind, paste ten off the big blind calls. We make a three point five calls. More like forty bigs, forty five bigs effective. Flop is a six three. We check. He bets. We raise. He calls. Turn is a seven. We ch oh, sorry, a seven three was the flop. Uh, we check he bets two diamonds. We have one diamond, the ten of diamonds. We check he bets two point four. We raise to seven point one. He calls. Turn we check he goes all in. We call, and he shows five three off. So that's good for us. And he was someone who was again very aggressive with me. So this is one time I was like, dude, I have to take the stand because this guy is really really getting aggressive. And he, it's the fourth hand that I've given up to him. Like, the spot where I folded ace pin on the turn with the ace pair because he three bet pre bet pick on the flop and rip turns. So I was like, and it was a connected ish board. So I was like, cool, whatever. It was ace, king, jack, and I think some uh, lower card, but like a nine or eight, and a flush complete. So I gave up on that. The ace was not a diamond. Like, there were three diamonds. The ace was not a diamond. So it was a annoying board to give up, but. We gave up because I'm like, I mean, I don't see people three barrel often enough. I don't see people get aggressive often enough. Turn, turn sorry, two barrel, but like a big barrel. And yeah, so this was one spot where I felt like we had to stand. Can't keep giving up every hand. How am I going off camera this time? This time is not even my fault, man. Come on, I've kept my leg on this tool. Yeah, and this is just tiring to say the least. Oh, apparently, okay. Bazi is giving a BSS super stack code. Whoever wants to take it can take it. Um, 10k for a 5.75 ticket. It's crazy. I am taking it as well. I have 70 bigs, but I'm still taking it because why not? We're losing nothing. And yep. Yeah. We're all in here with the nines. I think pretty standard. Nothing to discuss. Now I'm hoping they give a moneymaker ticket. And I'm also hoping we hold. I'm going to take the code actually. Oops, the deposit code enters invalid. Okay. Okay, it's so for whoever hasn't played. So I have already registered, so I'm not getting it. So it's actually better for y'all because y'all get to take it and we don't get to take advantage of it. 
it would have been a pretty cool spot to get an additional ticket but I would practically be wasting it I guess because I have 72 bigs I hope I don't need to rebuy Daily Sports thank you so much man and it's fine yo uh, people do like sometimes feel it and it's actually good he got it out of the system because otherwise you know you keep sitting with oh this guy did that against me this guy how can he call himself like a player and this better say it out and get done with it so yeah man no hard feelings babaji but for your own benefit i suggest uh don't get too much into that because it'll start making you play on tilt and that doesn't help Chupacabra. ace king let's hold if kings versus ace king let's hold it yep we hold this is the bss super stack so now we have 110 bigs we opened two i think this guy rips 30 something 32 33 straight 33 and yeah how much data 33 or 36 one second 33 okay no wait one second my hands not loading it's still showing the previous hand where he won three bigs so i'm not sure whether it's 33 or 36 37 yeah he ripped 37 straight what's my open small blind i opened a 2.5 jams for 36.92 i call off i mean I'm a station but still not fighting kings. So. <laughs> oh, okay. Siddharth, I'm assuming that's Sido nuts, but yeah. I think I'll take this wide open. It is probably a little too wide, but I think King 8 suited are open. Pio, King 7 suited, King 6 suited are both my Kaspi hands. That's the problem. I have two hands in Kaspis when I should just have one in general. But yeah, we're on stream. Nothing can be wrong when we're on stream, right? I learned from Chip and Chair, you know, the stream run good. I'm trying to get that. And multi wave, we're just gonna have to give up on this. And if I thought so, many people are calling out, definitely not open because this hand doesn't perform well multi wave for sure. This hand I would actually play against the big blind and probably bet this board and take it down, but the game doesn't work the way we want it to, so you have to be okay with that. We ordered some burger and fries, I don't know what I told you. We ordered a smash buff burger with piri piri fries, peri peri fries. Thank God you're working on me and stuff. It would have been so awkward if I had kept something off right now. Which is why I'm not changing the settings too much. take this spot clean just also see some stuff okay we're gonna have to hit not the worst board that's why it's not the worst board we are getting pretty decently lucky so like we are in the stream run good in our favor so it's not too bad Would have preferred if it started a little earlier, but I mean, okay, whatever. Whatever. Uh, 
Huh, again. Not against a 58, I don't open against someone else 58 because I'm not getting a full pre. Would have opened if you had like 24, 25, or below, obviously, but not above. Like even 28, I would have skipped because he's there as well, and he makes some bigger than normal jams. Like he won't just 3 bet, he'll just jam it, so. Kind of hurts a hand. I'm sure the BS has been starting stack 15k, right? Oh, so we have a decent stack there as well, we have 75,000. I want Gutshot Poker, Gutshot Magazine to cover Sad Poker Stories as well. Uh, I think there is a section for Bad B Stories. Generally, most players have it. Like, most um, news channels or poker magazines have it. So, should get somewhere you can do that. But, yes, that's the only way I know. Baki you can do it like that on stream, no? Faltu ka ab gutshot magazine me daoge, mera naam kharaab hoega. Log mere against fold hi nahi kharenge. Thoda it kind of works negatively for me. I don't think, Lele Sports, I don't think that's happening because I tried it and it's not working for me. So, that's the issue. And I assume that's the only reason it's not working for me. I mean, I'm getting the option to put the code. It's not even like I'm taking the code from someone. I am getting the option to apply the code and it says, oops, the deposit code entered is invalid. And I don't even apply. I don't even have to enter any code. I just click on apply and coupons and offers. It still says that. I'm assuming. Where are the terms and conditions for it? I don't see. Starts on twenty first April. Everything's cool. Ten thousand deposit. Everything's cool. Sorry. Uh yeah, man. I don't know. I can't get it. Apply. Yeah. I tried putting in, increasing the money. I'm putting in nothing. Just checking out everything looks okay on stream, sorry. Just, yeah, it looks fine, I think. Can't see too many things I can change in the moment and don't see anything I really need to change. Oh, we're on the King Six suited hand in the stream, right? Yeah. Six minutes is a long delay, but it's there's a good reason for it. Uh Bazi basically lets you like have a lot of time bank, right? So you can like have your normal time 15 seconds, then you have like a 40 second time bank generally which like refreshes really quickly. And then you also have that disconnect time and all of that. So like, I love it that it's amazing for helping players, but then that makes me have a long delay because if someone uh, like basically stream snipes, that becomes very awkward and they get a lot of time to do it. Because there can be some interesting spots that do happen, right? Where they have to do, like where they don't have to do it, but they end up doing it. Have to is one of the worst things I could have said. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Well, I just got a tough table in super stack. Got hold, baby, wish. I got rebuy to survive and all of these guys, so yeah. Toughish table ends. Ooh, nice. Ha, huh, shit. Should just bet the turn when he had the chance, but it's okay. I will still take a value bet on the river though, because my line makes no sense, so I'm gonna value bet it. I have to go small though, because I need to get called by non ASX. I don't think too many people have an ASX here, uh, and I think his stats are a little like leading me towards the fact that he might call light up. So. I think I should get caught. The problem is we have a six as well, right? But I still like my value bet because I don't see, I don't think he'll bluff as often as I want him to. I don't know. 
by TV and you know it's not supposed to be left to hard, right? Nope, we do not get called. We're stacking up slowly, not too bad. Yeah, you opened A6 off from uh, plus one, right? It's definitely why I have to mention that. Uh, don't imitate everything. Ooh, the better this time. Welcome, I'll push Thank you so much. You're very Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This three bar is annoying. This frequency is like seven. Seven is not special, right? Seven is very, very bleh. Doesn't give us any information on either side. If it was like four, you can easily fold. If it was like ten, I would have easily called. Because the sizing is small and we're in position, right? Sevens again, okay. And we're taking the more fun approach on the stream, so definitely calling then. If it was, if it was four, I would still probably fold on stream as well because uh, four is something against which we are kind of not doing well at all. Oh shit. Uh, cuts. That's the only problem with playing this hand, you know, like if you have to fold this flop for this plus size, then you'd rather not play it, right? Mm. Right, still, I don't, I mean, I don't know how... <sighs> the equity is rather... Problem is if we... Mm. Is this gonna be really aces? I mean, against aces we have some equity. We have a decent amount of equity as well, so yeah. I think we'll take it. This is one hand we didn't want to see. This is one hand we exactly didn't want to see, but yeah, stream run will continue. We're we'll gonna have to mark this hand for sure, because uh, I think probably while starting it, I'll say not to call pre, but I still don't mind my call pre because of the fact that this three bar was small, which is gonna be harder to study, and the player was not someone who's too tight, which probably that theory will get right. Okay, anyways, gonna switch off my camera for a bit, so I don't have to. Okay, there's one problem with the camera going off is you all cannot hear me either, which is not as much fun. So then we have to figure what we do about the food. Sorry about the sound for a minute. Be a little loud, but yeah. Hmm. Yeah, this we can definitely fold. Okay, we'll start with some fries at least, so that that doesn't isn't the most messy eat. So yeah. Uh, so there's no lag in the comments like when you type it I see it immediately as you type it but the thing is basically um, I'm uh, when I'm speaking I'm speaking and you'll hear it six minutes later so there is that delay that you have to deal with some piri piri fries Queens in the BSS super stack. Open to two point one. Someone opens to two point one five. Call, make it from the small blind about. I think nine point four five. We are eighty bigs. The one who called is at eighty, and the one who opens at forty five. So I think I don't mind making nine point five. And the one who called has a tendency to call a little too much. So. did call the flop is king a jack just gonna check it 
because he does call too much so he's gonna have a little more king x than he should but he's also gonna have a lot more air which i'm not worried about so and this hand can't get three sheets i don't want to bluff with it for sure Turn the board has a double flush draw, so I don't mind betting half pot. Problem is, not someone who I think will raise, that's the only thing. So, I, yeah, 24 7 2. So, I, someone who I don't think will bluff the raise, right? Who basically, like, if I, I bet 11 into 23, I don't see him bluff raising here. So, I think it's okay. I don't think it's too bad. I think we get caught by worse, right? There are two flush draws, there's a jack on board. And if he had a king, he could have bet the flop. If he didn't, then, I mean, yeah, we lose 11 bigs now, but. I don't think we're going for two streets either, unless the river is like a queen queen and not the flush variety, which now that I see is not possible. I have the queen of spades and queen of hearts. There are two clubs and two diamonds on the flop, so. Not a long tank. Just time bank on like six sections left. He folded a card. Guys, to a guy who has 58, he's gonna have so much air, but he's gonna hit this board so hard as well. It's kind of an awkward spot. I don't generally like betting this hand on this board, but I guess a guy who has 58. I'm gonna have hands like ace 9 off and stuff like that. But yeah. So I'm also gonna have hands like 8 9 suited, 8 7 suited. King 9 off. I mean, King 8 off. If this was later, I would have limped along. This is too early because these many people to act, right? Even though this guy makes our life easier by limping, these many people to act doesn't help. Good decision to order some PDP fries. Check four bigs. Uh, yeah, because the problem is he can rip behind. I'm not worried of his range, but this is a very icky spot. Yeah, this board is not fun. Just gonna give up again. Same problem with the play in the sand. You know, if you're gonna give up on this board anyway, and then just don't play it free. Can take this as a jam, can take this as a limb. I prefer the low variance shoot or the high variance shoot. What do I do? Take the low variance ones. Can't keep taking high variance every time, right? Ace high, I still don't need to bluff. Still will be calling one bet though. So, yeah. 
Still don't need to bluff. It doesn't help because. Don't mind calling some ace high above. Hmm. If the river card was lower, I would actually call it. So like a 4, 5 repeat, 3 repeat. I don't mind calling. It seems like a worse card. More pair options he can hit, right? Big cartoon, what do I do here? Problem is if I bet I don't think I can fold versus a guy who has 58. Good thing is I think he jam a lot of high cards, right? Yeah. I sort of think I'm folding. He has a king, God bless him, right? So. Yeah. It's a stream run good guys. Nothing I can get right, but Nothing that can go wrong, so. <laughs> the guy who has a 58 Weeper ends up showing King Fire there. Like, top pair plus straight draw. What the hell? I wanna say how bad are we running, but like, <laughs> can I even say that right now? I don't think so. I don't think we have any right to comment on our bad run. Clipping right, left, and center, man. It's insane. I don't mind it, not complaining, but just saying. I think someone in the start came and jinxed it, right? They said you rely on luck boxing only. So I was like, cool, I'll put some effort in that. It's working out pretty well. That was it. Who is this? Yeah, Aryan only told me, a guy named Aryan, yeah. Bro, you should focus on luck boxing. Cool, we're focusing on it. It's working. Eating like a little weirdo. But Sorry, just cleaning my hands a little bit so that <coughs> I'm not gonna eat right now. I'm actually gonna have a coke right now. Again, we're going like all shit on our health today. Yeah. Like really, really bad. But yeah, it's felt like today was the day. Streaming, having fun, playing a few tables for Sunday. Bricked hard. Can give ourselves that much today. I mean, still playing a few tables. So like, don't count me out. But yeah. Not the Sunday we would have hoped for, but I mean, we're streaming, we're having fun, so who cares? Who cares, eh? What does your ID stand for? It's a long story. It doesn't stand for anything, it's actually my 
brother's name. Not that long of a story, I guess, then. If I could say it in two seconds. But yeah. It doesn't stand for anything. My brother's name is Krish. It is obviously the best hand in poker. And yeah, that's it. <sighs> My god. Made an awkward hand against Old Baby. Like a good hand, but still somehow feels like a bluff catcher because the spot is so polar. Ah, yeah, I checked. I didn't even want him to check though, because we have two pair on the river, but like. It's still so polar. The board was ace king 4 3 6. We have ace 6 suited. So it's like, you don't even know whether you want to get jammed on, but you know you don't want to see a check back. So it's like, annoying. Can try a stunt with this. Can limp as well. Not a fan of folding in this spot. Yeah, we have like 95 bigs in the super stack as well. Red gems in 22 minutes. So not too bad. Wow. How late is Moneymaker Red gems in 30? 32 minutes? Nice. Are we going to go through on one bullet? What? That's crazy. The run good is real because I don't go through on one bullet almost ever, man. <laughs> I have a play style that doesn't really work well with a single bullet. Adjust my seat and see that I don't move so that my face doesn't cut again. I mean, my face is still cutting, but from the top this time, so I think. Sorry, guys, that's the best I can do. Oh, 39 people watching. Why is no one chatting? Really? No one has anything to say? Is poker going that good slash bad for all the others? Like, so, actually not even good or bad. Good or bad generally people talk, right? You're going so break-even-ish, so like dead that there's nothing to discuss right now. That's weird. We have 42 people watching now. I am just keeping a slight eye on my stream as well, so. I know what's up. How do we have 42 people and no one having anything to say? Because I can only talk to myself for so long, you know? Now that I'm pumping some coke and caffeine into my system, probably can talk to myself a little longer, but yeah. Yo, yo. It actually worked out well. I told you, right, the grind was going bad, like we were breaking everything, and now we are still on all the tables that we were at that time, so. Now it's going much better. Don't have anything more to register for the day, though. Skipping everything else. Just gonna enjoy our stream, gonna enjoy our grind today that's going on. We have the BS Super Stack and Sprint, both have 90 bigs plus, so. They're going insane. And a few other tables as well. Not playing the high roller right now, it needs a little more tension than I can give. Right now, so We're going to start opening two now because we're getting deeper, right? And we do open wide, so we can't afford to lose 2.5 every time we open. And we don't open 2.5 with our strong hands and two with our weak hands because then, especially since we're streaming, we're going to get caught on and exploited. So we'll start opening two from now, probably. 
avoid the 2.5 except certain scenarios when like probably if we're on the button and I feel think Floyd is being a little sticky then I might go to 2.5 otherwise we'll skip Mahakalo 3 this lead I do not like but I don't like just calling because the board's wet enough and I'm not worried I don't think he has too much 9x if the board was 10 10 6 I mean not 10 we have 10 but if it's like queen queen 6 I'd probably call even though I'm not worried of a single queen because it's on I mean even though queen is higher than 9 it doesn't really change too much because the idea is even if he has a 9 he beats me even if he has a queen then he beats me right the idea is basically here that yeah, we will still call, I guess. I don't think we fold, but I don't love it anymore. Yeah, definitely don't love it anymore. Probably will give up on the river. Like, we'll check back the river if we get a chance. Ah, yo, what the hell is this sizing? Is there any merit to converting a hand? Or oh, not that. I don't think he'll fold a 9, though. Not someone who I think will fold a 9 ever, so. No merit to really converting a 9. And converting to make a 9 fold. A6 is one hand you would definitely afford it, so, yep, it's fine. I mean, I can't say definitely that, confidently, but I think he would have definitely afforded it. I think he would have definitely afforded it. <laughs> makes no sense, but yeah. It makes a lot of sense to me. Well, yeah, he led a6 on that flop, right? So I like my check in general, but he got lucky, he clipped the turn. God bless him. Might need the rebuy. It looks like we might need the rebuy. Yeah. Oh, 27 minutes, right? We should need the rebuy. That's how I see it. Unless we run like we start, start, started running in the day, like the way we started the day, where it was like so dry. It was not even bad, like we aren't even running bad at all. I mean, obviously we're running very good in uh, all in spots, but we aren't getting hands enough to play, right? Early early into the stream, if you remember. And I don't want to have to force these kind of hands. Like this is a very forced hand, I don't want to do it. And especially not on the 10 river complete, because it does complete some hands. I don't think, I know he's not folding if he folds, but I don't think he folds anyway, so. I know my man Saraj. He's not folding to me for that. Especially with that no logic bet. For sure he's not folding. So 20, 20, 12. It's not that tight actually. I don't know why. Please don't run me dead at the end of the buy. That's very annoying. There 
is definitely not something you want. I mean, we're doing well on the super stack, and I can stream that if you bust this, but please don't. Please don't. I was itching and I have to be very careful I don't wipe it with a peely peely hand. <laughs> this could have been a mess. There was a spot actually in the BSS super stack which we're taking because I know the players and I think they're going to be a little over aggressive on the rebuy time. Uh, but might actually be a fold. Might not be the greatest jam. Might not be the greatest call off. But we were right with our read. Now let's hope we hold. No, we do not. Uh, basically, UTG opened uh, hijack jam 20 bigs when a small blind with 9 bigs. And in general, that should be an easy fold when UTG opened. So, UTG opened off like 15 bigs. Uh, but UTG is again someone who, towards the end of late track, will open wider because he wants to get more, involved in more pots and try to double. Or he doesn't mind rebank. Same with the guy who jammed, and I was correct. He ripped King Queen off, and. Excuse me. He ripped King Queen off, and. Yep. He hit tier 9s, so. Turn was the king. So we're down to 60 bigs in the BSS super stack. Not bad, but yeah. Ooh, 10, nice. Hopefully we find a way to get this all in pre-flop, but if not, it is what it is. <laughs> Eager for a classic at night. What time is it? I think it's still right. Not too bad. Hmm. This doesn't look great. It definitely doesn't look great because UTG is open. He's called our jam after that and he has 19 reaper. Let's hope for Ace King. Let's hope for 9s, but I don't think 9s really gets it in there. So. Ace King, or oh, we're screwed. Ace Queen is the same thing. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Streamline goes on. It's not, I mean, it's not kidding, bro. Streamline goes insane. No kidding. I think every flip we've had, right, today? We've literally had every flip, right? Yeah, I think so. I think we lost a flip. Ah, oh, we did lose one. The Ace King, of, Ace King with the King of Hearts. But that wasn't even so much of a flip because he still had... I mean, there was a flip, yeah. He had 55, he had 45, yeah. It's a flip. But yeah, we've had every single flip where we were actually like 50-50. So that's pretty cool. You definitely know you're running a Bavi V if that's the case. What is going on? My god, he hits as well? Nice. God bless him.
think HQ Studio also might be wired out there as a call. I don't think it might be a call. Because I'm jamming what's to the under the gun open, right? I'm not really jamming ace jack. It's 15 bigs, yeah, I don't think I'm jamming ace jack as much. So, yeah, I think it might be wired. Oops. And by struck him though. Oh, I said we're winning the flips. I forgot actually. We're winning the ones we're behind as well. <laughs> winning the flips is a whole different thing. We clip hard when you're behind as well, right? Yeah. Ah, yeah. Is he jamming that wide though? This can go all right. No, right? I don't think so. Yeah, no, I don't think he can call. So just give me a second. I'll be back, boys. Yo, what's up? Abhi tak stream chal raha. Hmm. Nay, not now. Sorry, boys. Yep. Trying to just call regarding something. Okay, my head is getting cut, dude. What the hell? What the fuck is going on? Oh, really shows how much we just bounce back on. Huh? Now my face is burning, right? Utkarsh Vesh Kind of like a 4 byte spot versus them I think he knows I'm 4 byte friendly He called? Wow I didn't see that I did not expect that In the BSS sprint though For what it's worth uh, We open cut off 50 bigs effective To 2 He makes it 6 from the big blind uh, From the button We make it 13.25 from the cutoff 13.5 from the cutoff he calls which I did not expect happening see where the flop small he calls turn we check give up and he wins alright guys I'll be back after the break
Sorry guys, just uh, you'll have to watch my table for a bit because I'm gonna be off the camera for a bit. I'm still eating. Was I'm eating the burger I ordered, and I don't wanna. That's a little messy eat, so I don't wanna bother anyone with that. So I'll be back in like five. I'm still gonna be playing, but just not showing my face for like five minutes.
put Ganon below the camera. What the fuck? How do I manage to not make it to the camera one time? Yep, so it was a good burger. Good. I want to say good meal. Like, good meal taste twice. So yeah, pretty good meal that way. Fun meal. Could definitely eat some uttapai and would be healthier. <laughs> What a weird spot in MBS and Super Stack. What, like 11.5 eggs? Hmm. Flop this guy check raises. Um, checks. Doesn't add up pretty well. Bottom card repeats. Flop check raises. I don't think he'll find him with bottom pair. I don't think he's someone who will. I hope I'm not wrong. Hmm. Check, check. It's easy. He found him with middle pair though, so fair enough. 8 do's off on king 8 3. Okay then, sir. If that's how we're playing, then that's how we're playing, buddy. Three pigs under the gun. Not fun. No fun for sure. Later hands in one minute, so it's like the last two levels of D-Buy, right? Annoying. Definitely annoying. Definitely annoying. This board doesn't help either. That action definitely does. I don't see the American betting too much because I don't know the. I mean, should four days king is queen. King Queen and stuff we beat. I don't think he folds like nine I mean nines set eights, so yeah. I don't really think this action has too much weight, I think checking is fine. Yeah, maybe the sandy folds, but I mean it's whatever, it's not great. So I can't even sit like this, and I can't even... Ay, ay, ay. Now the sound is audible, hello bro. Sorry I missed the chat man for a bit, I was just seeing my own stream, seeing everything's okay. Like, not the sound, so I don't even know about the sound, because I can't, it'll echo in the increase volume. Now the sound is audible, so I think it's fine. Uh, no one complained about the sound until now, so probably uh, you came in at a point where I was speaking to myself, so it seemed like I'm... Uh, <laughs> I say some shit like, yeah, fuck that is it. And it feels like I'm talking there, so it feels like you can't hear me. You're too zoomed in. There is ambience voice. Uh, why ambience voice? Because I can't do anything. I am assuming it is the AC. So can actually do something. It is. You are wrong. So this can be done, I think this should be a little less ambient noise because I can just see the AC was pointing to the mic which I did not realize till now. 
थैंक यू फॉर दैट बड़ी एंड यू आर टू जूम डन भाई उसका कुछ नहीं कर सकता यार अभी किधर इफ आई सेट लाइक इफ आई सेट लाइक दिस इट्स अनकम्फर्टेबल फॉर मी टू प्ले आई गेट दैट इट्स कम्फर्टेबल फॉर यू टू वॉच बट ट्राई फॉर लिल बट आई गेस बट एच डायरेक्ट टू प्ले दिस बॉडी इज ऑल वाकड़ा तेकड़ा Baby is jammed under the gun in the BSS super stack. Twelve eggs. Do we have a stack off? It's fine, but not great. Yeah, definitely not great. Oops, he has nuts. Yes, queen ten suited. Flop is uh, two diamonds. Turn is a diamond, and he wins. Okay then. Need to stay in the stable to run good on it as well, I guess. Will I still get a ticket for anything? No, I. Mm, nope, no ticket for me today. And the very next hand, the buyer survive opens on fifteen bigs. We have ace queen off on the button. We're gonna be jamming and gonna tell you what happens after that. <coughs> Actually, now my voice might feel lower because I'm sitting a little more far and moving less. Can't say talking less. Hey, Achilles, thanks, man. These guys, bro. The buyer survive has kings, and he holds. Yes. So now we're down to ten bigs. <laughs> That was quick. That was a quick boom boom, and we're out. Not out yet. I mean, you have ten bigs, and in money maker, you come back every time from ten bigs. So it's possible we do come back again. Let's hope that happens. Sir for grand Madrid, probably go, what you said at twelve thirty, right? Probably put it on on my screen in one of the corners. Seems like a good sweat.
think a few people found out by now that we are on the wider side. stand in a bit again feeling the tiredness why is my camera burning I can't understand that super weird Stream looks okay. No problem there. But yeah. Okay, guys. The you're gonna have to see me zoomed in because it's tiring to sit behind. Man, we're getting the beautiful hands. Uh, play where we have nine bigs and the bs has super stack so annoying i'm getting six five suited and stuff so annoying where am i from i'm from mumbai where are you from we're all in the bs has print Hijack opens two bigs. We have ace jack off for 28, 30 bigs. In the cutoff, and we take it. G Q B V Q G Q barbecue. Hello. I don't know whether it has anything to do barbecue, but whenever I see BBQ, I'm gonna read it as barbecue. Shit. Mm -mm -mm. Did not think this through. I'll be back in a bit, guys. I use this hand for PD PD and then I wipe my eye with it. Not the greatest idea.
Yeah, we're back, but not in the best shape, so I might have to go again. Ugh. Eye is burning. But we have some run good in BSS super stack. This is so stupid, man. Uh, yeah. We jam King 10 suited from the button versus cut off open. We have King 10, he has Ace King, flop is 10 high, and we hold. Ooh, my eyes burning though. I don't know how much you can see, but shit, that's bad. We'll have to go back again to wash it in a bit. Uh, tried washing it a little bit right now. Don't know. That PDP spice is strong, eh? <laughs> Find out the actual how strong it is. But yeah. Hey, now we have seven minutes to we can open. We'll be taking a break again from the stream. So annoying, that's so stupid. Mm, I have to wash it in two, three minutes again. Come on, man. Gonna have to come back and have to wash it again. So annoying. Ace suit, so thank God. Ace five suit. What am I even seeing? No, guys, I can see properly. Eyes are not affected, but it's mad annoying. How fucking weird is this? Should generally be checking this. My god, this guy, man. Annoying. Yes. Just pissing off with the eye, man. <laughs> Still burning. Yeah, this is my right hand. This is not the one I ate with, but... I misclicked <laughs> with my life. I used my left hand to clean my eye with which I had eaten PD PD. And I knew it was going to be a bad decision to not wash my hands immediately. I was like, it's a stream time and whatever, we'll just wash it after. <laughs> Fucking stupid. Uh, yeah. I can actually feel my right eye burning, which is the annoying part. Check going with it on this flop. Yeah, check going with it on this flop. Let's hold. Let's hold. Nice. So basically, as I said, stream run good is still there. I mean, we're still ahead. Of my God, I gotta check my eye. Shouldn't become too problematic. That's the only thing. Hmm. Let's go like this. Decrease the brightness. The 
doesn't look too bad, but it isn't feeling too great. So yeah, I'm mean, obviously not like insanely like not paining or anything on that side. Because otherwise, I would I would be able to sit here and I would probably cut off the stream. Uh, but it isn't great for sure. Yeah, it is burning a little bit, especially these corners. How are we this stupid sometimes? Fuck's sake. Well, I think take this for as a 3 bed jam. Could take this as a 3 bed call off, but I'm not a fan of 3 bed calling off this. Uh, especially, I don't think Salon should put as many bluffs against me because he knows I'm a little call heavy. I don't like a yard. Oh, this is the last level, right? I think it's okay. Thing is, I won't be rewind though because it'll be like probably 6 picks, 7 picks. No, maybe 8 picks, but yeah, still won't be rewind. And one other thing is, shouldn't have taken this much time to jam. But yeah, let's see. I don't like. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, then. Let's hold. Let's hold. Nice. Stream run code is real, man. The stream run code is fucking insane. Sorry, boy. I'm on stream today, so nothing personal. The stream just wants me to survive. Can't help it. Stream not got us mad, eh? Badbit counter hasn't gone through the roof, I thought it would. But I think we won majorly, we won a lot of flips, right? I mean, we're running very good, don't get me wrong. We're running really good. But a lot of them have been like flips are like 70 30s at max, not 80 20s. So the. Sorry, man. Sorry. Sorry, if I my, got my camera. I can't focus on the camera right now, guys, for a bit. I is still burning a little bit. Obviously, way better right now. Like, it feels like it's more normal right now, but yeah, it was annoying for a very long time. It's still hurting a little bit, as I said, but I don't want to keep complaining. We have work to do. Oh, BSS print prize bubble? Sick, didn't know that. And that shows how much attention I'm paying at the moment here. Yeah. We're all in the BSS super stack and I actually literally just checked that we're not in the bubble because otherwise I'd have to slow down. I think it's still fine though, we have flushed on the flop and 10 digs in our hand. Uh, but yeah, not. I mean, yeah. Could have probably folded this pre flop, yeah, Jack for suited. Versus nines. Nope, I don't think we hit. No, we do not. And we bust the BSS super stack. <sighs> Flop is 10 3 5 2 clubs. We have jack 4 of clubs. Turn was an ace. Not the worst because we also pick up our gutty. And he had nines, right? So it didn't help his hand. So we could hit a jack of 4 2 3 5, right? No, ace 3 5, right? What did, where's the flop? Yeah, 3 5. I mean, a jack, a deuce, or a club. Yeah, sure. Running on lag in real life. <laughs> Let's go and check this flop. Not great. Not the worst, but he didn't lead actually, so it's kind of better for us than worse because he was leading a lot. I'm very, very, very tempted to go for thin value here. Like, mad tempted. Might actually be shooting myself in the foot here. 
I actually think I'll get raised as a bluff more often here, so I would probably call if he raised, which isn't maybe a great idea. But yeah, at least I would do that. Is all I'm saying. I mean, obviously it depends on the race side if he rips. I don't think people rip enough as a bluff. Ayah. Now the spot king versus queen he it's a queen on flop. And we're all in like 40 pigs each. <sighs> not fun. Definitely not fun. Just two tables remaining the money maker and the sprint. But the money maker has a decent stack, so yeah. And we're in the money in the sprint, so that's good as well. Who's on the stream? Who are you asking for? Who's asking how is the ID come to it? Nice hand, Krish. A -A. Which hand is that? The S9 favorite? Did I'll see that on stream? I don't know what I was seeing right now. Ace, nine, spades. No, I don't think I saw that yet. Okay, I'm not lying myself. Ah, okay, well, I've seen the Ace, Ace 9 favorite right now. So Krish has not seen that yet, I guess then. Oh, this is where we clip like a madman. Yeah, so that was stream not good, and it felt good. <sighs> and I guess Krish came home. Okay then. Hi, yeah, GG, Sarge. Time you watch the face, I know, man. Sorry, just not able to focus right now. Take this three best part in general versus him. I don't mind calling, I'm not folding, so.
Yeah, this is a spot I probably will fold. I don't see the merit in calling here. Don't see the merit in uh, jamming, obviously not. Don't see the merit in anything else, right? No point of clicking, nothing. Calling can be okay. I don't think it's too bad. But I'm just avoiding because someone on the tighter side in general, I think. 19, 15, 6, 6 is not ideal. If he had like a 10% 3 bet, I would probably call. If he had 12, 13, God bless him, I was going with it. But since he has only 6, I'm doing nothing. Nothing. ID name run good is here too, but on Chamat I'll give you Krish. Don't act too smart. You wanna come here and chill, come for a bit. But yeah. Any sure was popcorn has come for that hand anyway. Yeah, I'm giving popcorn hands, I'll give you that though. Like the popcorn run good it is. Uh, let's hope we hold throughout though. Because if we hold throughout the attack tournament, that means we win, right? Yeah. <laughs> 10.56 lakhs, not a bad sum to be fair. Nothing to crew about. At this point, I don't even know what I want him to do because if he jams, I'm gonna have to fold. I hate it, but I'm gonna have to. If he calls, it's ugly as well. Gukesh. I don't know what you mean. But. I don't even know what I want on this flop in turn, man. I think this isn't too bad, but it's not fun for sure. It's not fun when you bet into five people like that. Turn call as well. Does a stupid lead make any sense? God, it's stupid on my own, I know, but it's like a, I mean nonsensical, like it doesn't make any like logical sense. Would it actually work here though? That's my question. Something like this, just keeping us out of the pot small. And I don't think I'll get bluff raised often enough. I mean, obviously I can get raised. It's no problem with getting raised here, but I don't think I'll get bluff raised often enough. Yeah, now I think we can just fold. I don't see the option of getting bluff raised here. Yeah. If you're getting bluff raised, kudos to him, man. Good pull. Really good pull. And there's obviously this guy behind me. And there's one more thing. I don't think it goes check check if uh, someone wants to raise anyway. If it's going to go check check, generally I'm going to get called anyway. It's called with a fade draw for that long. My god. Okay, boy. Okay, boy. How many bigs did he lose last time? Lost like 23 bigs out of 31, right? He should just probably be jamming the flop then. If he wants to continue with his flush draw. It's pretty chill board to jam on the flush. Fuck. Keep remembering my camera shit. Fares by some value I shouldn't have given, but someone called me a station, I stuck to it. Alright, 
guys are feeling much better touch with she's just cutting again to what the fuck is going on probably open this even though he's aggressive here and small he's pretty passive and yep also whoever's new year i think we have like 40 people watching again yeah whoever's new year if you can like the video subscribe to the channel Keep coming back. We're going to have streams throughout the week mostly. So, should be a fun one. And yeah, show your love, man. Show your love however you like to. But yeah, show your love if possible. Thank you. This again slightly wide, but I still don't mind opening it. This kind of attack, this kind of screws us because I want to play a pot with him, so it's actually a good hand to limp along. But he's aggressive enough that if two of us limp, his jamming range will go super wide. He's not someone I'm worried of aggression, right? Yeah, no, he's not someone I'm worried of jamming, so just him. So I'm probably not this limp doesn't work as well if it was probably a okay, well, it backfired. But if it was like a player here who's more like him, I don't mind limping because he'll call long more than he'll jam. But since it's a player like him, can fold as well. I mean, can definitely fold anyway. I just want to play a pot with him because he's making some weird leads on the flop and stuff like that, which could work out well for us. Which should work out well for us in general. So, might not work sometimes, but should work in general. see it on my face my goods this is the oh, one thing this is zero brightness this is full brightness yeah like this is what i see my phone on shit i might go blind soon but i don't need to use on zero brightness either yeah these guys in particular small blind yeah not a great board against a small blind anyway and i missed that i thought he was in the hand as well but we could actually try this then since we now misread the hand i thought it was the button and the small just missed the fact that he doesn't have cards but like he's lit up right compared to the others so yeah Misread the hand, made some money. Can you talk again on the three word percentages and how you call based on that? It depends. So basically, uh, it depends on how I think the player is playing, right? If he's three writing too much, you can call more because your hands are going to be more live in general. Like if you have a hand like King Ten suited, 
maybe not the best example, but if you say a hand like Ace Jack suited, right? Again, someone who has like a 5% 3-bet, I would not call it, even though theory says, I mean, theory obviously doesn't have a 5% 3-bet at that spot. But even though theory says you can call Ace Jack suited, I would not call it only because it's like, the person has to have some frequency of King-10 suited. When he's generally 3-betting 5%, he won't have any King-10 suited. So Ace Jack suited is not as good as it was. You're going to run into Ace King, Aces Queens way higher than you would run into King-10 suited, King Jack suited, Queen Jack suited. All these kind of hands, you know, Jack-10 suited. So your ace jack, ace queen, ace queen might not actually be doing very well in that spot. But again, I guess a player who has like 13% three bet when he's supposed to have only like nine, ten in that spot, it kind of works out way better because it's like okay, he was never supposed to have like full frequency king ten off, but he does. He's never supposed to have full frequency queen jack off, but he does. So now when you have a hand like ace jack, you can start like really printing against him by calling, or you can even jam on him because he has to three bet fold so much that you just pick up six big so often. Sometimes you're going to run into it, it's a variance high method, but I mean, in general, you are making money on that spot. Again, someone who has like a 13% three bet, and then like a high fold to see, a fold to uh, four bet because he has to, right? Can't three bet king nine off and call it off every time, right? I mean, you can't do it ever, but like people are going to do it once in a while because no gamble, no future. Well, it was in this small, small audience, like four, four bigs, three, three bigs. In the BSS sprint. Not a good day for us in general, I guess, because we have only two tables left and they don't look too bad. They don't look too bad, don't get me wrong, because this one doesn't look as bad as... Hmm. But the BSS sprint doesn't look too great either. I will raise now. I will ch check raise now. But yeah. Now I don't mind going with it, right? This hand is way better on this flop than Ace Queen is pre flop for 30 bigs. Yeah, with the Ace of Clubs and everything. Sometimes we get folds too often, but I don't like just calling. Again, someone who's playing tighter, their range is going to be a little stronger, so they're going to have more often that they have King Queen, more often they have Queen Jack Silver than hands like, you know, Ace 9 off, which is less likely. So when you drop his weak hands in the range, his strong hands automatically become a bigger percentage of his range, right? Obviously that means aces and kings are a bigger percent of his range as well, but I mean, I can't be worried of monsters under the bed, right? If he has that, God bless him, he can take my money. It is break time. Be back in a bit.
what's up guys sorry took an extended break I was playing on my phone but yeah this seat this is too big right I have to readjust the tables and stuff so yep this is good I guess I'll show the whole table on the inside and you can show the whole table on itself still running with 15 bigs on the BSS sprint 71 left in that Hundred two out of four hundred sixteen. So basically, about twenty people left, no, thirty five people left for money. Something like that. Twenty nine people left money. Oops. Maths is not mathing. Seeing seven off in the big. Jams for eight pigs, not calling. If I suited, we're gonna have to. I'm too scared to wipe my eye, man. <laughs> After the last. Nineteen eight. Yeah, it's gonna be a lock part when he comes in, right? Cool. We'll get bluffed less, which is why I decided to call. We can realize the equity more. Which is why, see this turn we would have never made it to if it was not a lock pot, right? Obviously we'll have to fold more on the river than if you bets the river we'll have to fold. But yeah. The reason I called was obviously pretty clear that he doesn't open too tight. Not too tight as in it's not wide, but like 19 is fine. It's not like a 14 or something. And once he calls, it's a dry side pot, right? I mean, dead side pot, which he won't bluff into. So, yeah. Keeping on doing this. 
I would have not limped along anyway uh, because of these stacks, but this is getting. Making it very juicy though. Making it very tempting for me to limp along. Like these kind of hands, but not with these two stacks behind. If there were actually 220 big blind stacks, I would have probably limped along as well, because they wouldn't jam as much and we're in position post flop. But yeah. junk on my table because of the burger stuff in. see these actions are making it so tempted to do something and I mean do something with such a hand it's limp along but no worth it again same problem Still grinding, who are the still in the money maker? Clean open, we call him, we call him, we, not worth calling him actually because he's gonna call along a lot. I don't think he's someone who'll jam like ace four off and stuff like that, you know. Which versus my open, you could actually do it.
blind jumps are big, huh? This is 25 pixel first, huh? Yeah. And the bubble against the guy was 35, 8 is not, not the ideal spot you want to be in. I think I would call ace 5 more than ace 6 if I want that additional equity. Might look tight, right? It's 3 away from the money. I don't think he's jamming wide like that's almost impossible that he jams wide. You have to hate money to jam wide, yo. I didn't see this, thank god. Because if he falls, I'm gonna rip 100%, right? <laughs> Pretty optimistic open, I'd be jamming a lot here, just not this. Creep into the money that quickly. Okay, we might actually bust the. Yeah, we might actually bust the. Sprint. So we had king queen nine bigs effective ran into ace jack and we had a third guy who called actually four jack off so yeah that's not great either i mean that was good sorry but it's not great that we didn't hit that would have been a really good part a nice 30 big part Okay, now feels good that we crept in the money. So we can open this instead of jamming this and hope we get jammed on.
Yeah, it's gonna fold. There's too many Star Wars stacks. 15, 20. Trace, I'm not sure, but I mean, the. Let's make some wider gems. And transfers I'm gonna fold, so. That might not be the worst, but otherwise, in general, it's not a great setup. Fold to his jam, fold to his jam, call his jam. I think he signed off, I still open. This is like. Maybe I'll open, maybe I'll not. This hand, I like in a big line for sure. We will mostly be going with it if the action starts from here or beyond. This is where it becomes hard to like jam versus. So what's this position we probably call? Yeah, now it's easy if he does anything. If he dips, makes our life super easy, obviously. Yeah, makes our life super easy. Now let's hold. Oof. Stream run will come to an end, I guess. Have three bigs though. And with the way we've been running before this, we could still convert. <laughs> uh, that's fine. I think he played correctly, so. Kudos to him. We got lucky against everyone, right? Someone's gonna get lucky against us. Okay, this is one of the best hands you could get for this stack. Hmm. Let's hope we hit a hold or do what we need to. Ah, <laughs> already ready to get off my seat though, because we're done with the grind after this. It's brick day. Ah, the min cash job today. I found it. A little annoying, but that's okay. I don't think there was a page jump. Actually, this was stupid. I should have waited through. No, that's not a page jump. Good. GG's. The fun stream. We'll probably do it tomorrow or the day after. Let's see. See you guys. GG. Thank you.